Hey guys, today in this video we will talk about how to make the new component from the existing component in the assembly. Just like we have these two components assembly, uh, I want to make the copy of this sub uh, this part, but as a new part. Uh, let's do like this. Why I need to make the new copy, new component from here existing? Because I need the same feature, but we need to add some more additional features, like uh, some drill the hole here. But if I do in the same part, it will reflect here as well in the both components because it's a just copy, right? So how to make the new component from the existing component? So let's uh, drag this uh, copy of this component, just rotate. Let's add the mates. Okay. So what I want to do, I want to drill some holes here on this top panel only, not on the bottom. But as you can see, this is a both uh, just a copy. It's the same component. So what I do here. I just click on this part. Okay, let's do first, let's drill the hole some. All right. Extrude. Okay. If I go to the assembly, you will see it is also reflecting in this bottom panel. I don't want to reflect in the bottom panel. There is a two options we can use. Either we can make the com configuration here, add configuration and suppress these components. Let's add this one. All right. Now there's a two configuration and I'm going to just suppress this, but not from the another configuration. The holes will be there. So let's go there. Now you will see there's an option coming for the two configuration or configuration box showing up. Here I will use standard here as we have the hole. Here I'm not go going to the another configuration. So you will not see the holes here because I have suppressed. But what I need to do, I want to make the copy with another part. I don't want to use this same part here. I'm going to delete this configuration. We don't need that one. We also don't need that one. <laughs> All right. So just right click on this component part and make as a independent component here make independent their option will show save component with new name hit ok yes uh, ok top palette 1 now this is a top plate 1 and this is only top plate now I'm going to add hole here and you will see there's no hole here showing All right, so now we have two another components separate and with the separate names. Okay, guys, thank you very much.